I mainly want to make this video on the their SBs, like if it's a good sell or hold or sell now, hold or sell now. Honestly, if you have a pair right now. Hey man, say man, it's Armand Subaru in the cut on the mic. As you can see, and today we're gonna to be discussing is the their SBs, aka the their skateboard, Nike SBs, Dunk Low, whatever you know what I'm saying, full name, um, a good hold or sell now because they do this is like an early today is the fourth of august they come out the sixth so in two days um i guess that's they come out on a tuesday which is kind of like interesting for a sneakers release well i guess not too crazy but you know they already came out on the their skateboards website i've already made like two videos on these so go check out those videos if you try and get like more information on this shoe but um today i'm just gonna be kind of going over like i already said so honestly they come out the sixth Right now, I'm going to pop up prices. Let me um, look them up on StockX. I'm going to pop up on the screen. Okay, right now, I'm going to pop up the stock, like what um, StockX has them at, like what's market on these right now. Um, these right now aren't too high, but they're not too low. They're around like $170 to $200 right now. So nothing too crazy. Um, I already have like, I have one size coming in. I don't, I don't know if y'all can see my cat right now. Hold on a second. All right, I had to do a quick camera adjustment. My cat was in the screen. But um, yeah, so looking at prices right now, they're like I already said, they're around $170 to $200. I see prices coming down a bit on these, but there will be a lot of L's on sneakers because I just found out supposedly this is like I heard this from someone. Apparently, there's only going to be 11,000 pairs dropping on sneakers. So I already knew this, this drop was going to be super limited. So a lot of people will take L's and that will cause prices to like skyrocket. Well, not skyrocket, but go up in some prices. And over time, I mean, just like every Nike SB, like that's decent, that's a collab. They, they usually go up over time, uh, especially in like, you know, bigger sizes, like more sought after sizes. I don't know if my cat's on screen right now, but yeah. So I do see this being a decent hold. Nothing too crazy though. It's not like a, you know, Futura SB or nothing like that. Not like that type of hold, but this is a nice pair. I do like it. It does have like some nice details on it. I can't wait to get my pair in hand so I can do like kind of a review and like overlook on the shoe. Um, I was thinking about like telling a pair of these, but I'm not like too crazy on it if I don't get a pair. Oh, my cat, like, kind of in this hold on a sec. Yeah, I'm not like too crazy about this pair, but I do like them. They are nice. It's got a nice little dark green on them. Nothing too crazy. You got that like little cool like thing on the lace tag. I'm not really the biggest fan of that, but pretty nice pair overall. It's a collab, Nike SB. So these will probably do good over time. And as we're approaching like Christmas and stuff, you know, all sneakers usually go up during like Christmas. So. I do see this being a decent hold, but do I like see like, would it make sense to go buy a bunch of these at market right now? Uh, I, I wouldn't say so. If you can get a, a couple pairs right now for like under market, like maybe like around 160 highest, like that's like a decent buy, but I do see these hitting around like 150 in like some of the smaller sizes, some of the, like the less sought after sizes. So I wouldn't say like, you know, go buy like, you know, a bunch of pairs of these, but if you do, you know, if you can get your hands on a pair of like 12s or 11s or 10s or even like you know 13s usually a money size and sbs which has my size so hey y'all 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 chill on the 13s though okay if you don't wear 13 just chill on the 13s but yes sir um this is going to be a decent hold nothing too crazy though they definitely will do good good over time but that just depends if you have the capital to hold on to them but yeah overall pretty nice shoe nothing too crazy um if you're just finding this video drop a like drop a sub but yeah, there will be some other cool SBs coming out soon, like the birdies and stuff. So I am looking forward to, you know, getting those two and seeing how those do. But yeah, 11,000 on sneakers, that's very low stock. So I do, you know, that is like, you know, that's pretty low. So I do see these prices going up a little bit. But yeah, I, I have a pair coming in, like I already said. So stay tuned for that. But yeah, um, nothing too crazy. Just want to kind of go over this. I also kind of want to go and talk about like sneakers day, which is supposed to come out like August 8th. There's been, there's like a lot of sneakers releases um coming up in august which is good it's my birthday month my birthday is august 7th so in like three days but yes sir um hold on a sec y'all but yes sir uh sneakers day is like apparently there's gonna be like a sneakers day on august 8th last year if you know like there was people rumoring like there's gonna be corrido dunks and stuff coming out on sneakers day which ended up being all capped they literally dropped like i think the saint john dunks and a pair of red cement so it was awful with sneakers day so don't get your hopes up honestly the sneakers day stuff is like a lot of clickbait you know a lot of people are clickbait and if, if i doubt they'll drop apparently they're saying Haritos are going to drop again this uh, on august 8th which is like sneakers day but i feel like this is all lies i feel like this is all cap 
so yeah don't get your hopes up too high on that but yeah that would be dope you know to get like a re-release of some sbs and some cool sought after shoes but you already know if they did that stock would be super low there would be like little to no l so it wouldn't really do much for people who want the pair to be honest so there would just be like one out of a million people that got it and prices would probably stay pretty high on each pair too because like i said they wouldn't drop many pairs of each pair like if they did drop like apparently i saw like they're gonna drop the trophy rooms bunch of pairs let me look it up real quick yeah apparently they're saying jumpman jacks military blues canaries sb4s like ah this is all cap i don't believe this at all i mean i don't know what the source is like i mean I'm, I'm seeing this on like cop calendar on instagram i just don't see this happening loss and bounds i don't see none of this happening but you know we'll just have to wait and see till august 8th that's in four days so we'll just have to wait and see um yeah I, i'm gonna stay tuned for that i'm definitely let y'all know sorry if my cat's tail like in the camera view but yes sir nothing too crazy just want to kind of go over you know sneakers day and is the their sbs a good hold honestly they are a decent hold but nothing too crazy there is going to be like other drops put your money towards but this is a decent pair to you know cop for retail so if you can get this pair for retail or around retail yeah i would definitely grab them and especially if you have the capital to hold then yeah hold on my cat just freaked up the camera angle again but back in this video that would be nice to get like a harito or some cool like pair actually dropping on sneakers day i don't see them dropping all these nice pairs on sneakers day because i mean what is a sneakers day is that like i don't really understand what the meaning is that is that like when the sneakers came out or something i just don't really understand it i don't see why they would do that i doubt they'll do that but we'll see um nothing too crazy the, um, their SBs, they come out August 6th. There's another fire pair, the uh, Nigel RM, that's coming out the 8th, I'm pretty sure. So go check out that video I made on those. Nothing too, too crazy. Um, if they do come out with these restocks, though, I, that's going to be interesting to see what like that does the market. Because, you know, restocks always kill market on pairs. But, I, like I said, I doubt there will be like many pairs that's coming out. So we'll just have to see. Hopefully they do like come out with something fire on sneakers day or whatever because like that's literally like the day after my birthday So that would be a pretty dope, you know I'd be pretty dope if they can come out with some cool pairs and maybe I can get a god I'm on one we'll see but I doubt they'll do that I mean, I just know like it's just like all talk that like, you know, there's nothing there's nothing confirmed from Nike Like like I said last year they like every, every sneaker youtuber was hyping up like sneakers day There's gonna be this coming out. There's gonna like no like is this all cap? I, I don't see it happening this year neither, but we'll see um nothing too too crazy though y'all i mainly want to make this video on the their sbs like if it's a good sell or hold or sell now hold or sell now honestly if you have a pair right now and like you got it for you know retail i'd honestly hold it till sneakers um till they drop on sneakers day and then i mean on you know, not sneakers day but you know till they drop on sick on august 6th so in two days wait till they drop and then when people take their l's that's when i'd sell your pair that's like the best time to sell your pairs while it's hot but people who are into holding and stuff like that and like collecting you know this isn't a bad pair to hold. This is like a nice, decent SB. So yeah, like I already said, I'm not trying to repeat too much info information in this video, but definitely a nice pair. Nothing too, too crazy. Um, yeah, hopefully I can get a couple pairs in hand for these. I was gonna do like an on-feet review of these, but we'll just see. I'm not really too, too crazy about these. So I don't know if I want to tow a pair, but honestly, if I got a size 13 of these, size 13 is always doing good over time. So I'll probably just hold on to that pair. So I'd actually be partaking in the hold um I, but if you if you like really want to make some a quick flip then yeah sell now right when they come out and a lot of people are going to be taking else because there's only eleven thousand pairs dropping i know some someone in my comments was asking like how many what stock numbers on this pair so that i just told you it's a, um estimated to be eleven thousand pairs but we'll have to see i'm gonna have to like get stock pulled up well, let me check let me check this discord let me check um let me check some real quick y'all yeah okay well apparently nobody really there's not really like any like stock monitors or anything popping up for these yeah i see that coming out like probably the day before drop so we'll just have to see y'all uh, literally the day before drop is tomorrow so maybe i'll just wait till tomorrow get like exact stock and then i'll post a video but that's kind of like some exclusive information so i don't know if i'm gonna put exactly stock just know it's gonna be around 11,000 pairs estimated so that's not confirmed though so yeah stay tuned though definitely a pair to go for if you like them and you know definitely gonna be a nice quick flip but sneakers is not the way to get this pair go check out my other videos if you want to like find out how to actually possibly cop this pair for well it's kind of late now i'm not gonna lie it's kind of late now because skate shops already did their raffles or their first come first serve a skate shop near me did a first come first serve and they literally they literally sold out in like an hour so that's a little bit suspicious but not too much at the same time because people people be like you know whenever a skate shop posted people would be going to the skate shop quick so you have to be quick on it and you have to be pretty near your skate shop that skate shop was like an hour for me so it would have been a waste of time i mean by the time i got over there they'd probably be sold out and that'd be a big l but nothing too crazy y'all drop a like drop a sub let me check how long this video has been real quick okay bet yeah um yeah so that's pretty much all i had to go over is there sb is a good sell or hold now 
honestly sell now if you have a pair like on sneakers whatever people take their l's on like whenever they drop on sneakers sell it now if you want to make a quick flip but if you if you want to make it like you know if you're interested in holding and you like have the capital to hold and you know if it goes down 10 bucks so what if it goes up 30 bucks it goes up 20 bucks like that's good bet but um honestly i would see these being a decent hold in bigger sizes but just like more sought after sizes too like you know like just sought after sizes if you know you know like you know I'm not gonna you know probably like you know to be honest like tens and stuff like that you know just good sizes if you know you know but yeah and then also i want to talk about sneakers day i feel like it's all capped but we're gonna have to see till august 8th i'll definitely stay tuned and like you know keep y'all posted on that but yeah i'm probably gonna end off the video here drop a like drop a sub all that good stuff and um, expect more fire videos on the way i got some you know good content on the way hopefully um some sneaker events or some pop up around me but we'll have to see so yeah, I'll definitely, you know, pop up to that if there is one. So yeah, drop a like, drop a sub, all that good stuff, and peace.